Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to edit the homepage of your Joomla website in 2023. So the homepage is often the first impression visitors have of your website. So it's important to make it engaging and informative. So in this video, we'll guide you through the steps of editing the homepage of your Joomla website. So make sure to stick by and let's dive right into it and let's get started. Before we start with this video, Make sure to watch it from now till the end, so you have full experience. So first, let's start by opening whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. In my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser, and of course in your case you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open your preferred browser or the, your browser that you have in your PC, make sure to go to this URL section and simply type joomla.com or .org at the same. Of course, once you do so, you'll find yourself on this website. As you can see here, you can simply, uh, as you can see, launch your Joomla site, build fully functional Joomla websites, and experience the world best content management system for free. Of course, so you'll have to type a website name here for yourself. And as you can see, it will be the website name .joomla.com. And that's going to be the domain name of your website. So you can simply type whatever you want here as an example. So I'm just going to type random stuff and click on launch now. Once you do so, of course, they will tell you to choose a version. As an example, I'm just going to choose this and click on continue. Of course, the difference between those two versions and this one, this you will have to renew it every day and this every month. So click on continue. And as you can see here, you'll have to full uh, or uh, create your account if it's your first time. So if it's your first time, make sure to create your account by filling these informations. And of course, you can even uh, log in with or create your account with Facebook, Google or Twitter. So, of course, they will fill this free information for you if you don't want to do it manually. Or if you have an account, make sure to sign into it and you will be good to go. Once you do so, once you sign in into your account or you just created your account, you will find yourself on the dashboard of Access Nets or it's actually your Joomla. Of course, here you'll find every website that you have in your account and you'll be able to access your websites by going, as an example, this one. So simply go and click on manage. Once you click on manage, of course, you will have to wait or until this page loads. As you can see, it's not a problem of uh, internet or something because it's, they are not refreshing uh, very fast. It's a problem of a heavy load uh, because I'm using just the free plan. Of course, for you, if you upgrade into uh, a better plan or you go for a premium plan you will not have this uh, options or this problems of the heavy load and it will be slow so of course for you it will be very fast so of course here if you want to access this example as you said uh, make sure to expand this application and here of course you'll be able to access or to preview your website so if you click here or simply overview those will take you to the same option and here you'll find your website as you can see for me the website is empty it has one page which is the home screen of course for you if you want to log in into your uh, dashboard of uh, or C panel of your website and you want to start editing on it, you'll have to click on login into Joomla uh, or Joomla, sorry. And that will take you directly to the dashboard of your Joomla website right away. So here you'll be able, as you can see, to see your site. So you'll be able to add some users, articles, article category, any plugins, models, or any media. So of course, you'll be able even to click on the settings button at the top right corner and click on this edits button. If you click on edits here, you'll be able to edit on this option, a group, a header icon, and a lot of other stuff here. Make sure if you change anything here to save and and you will see everything that you changed here if you refresh, if you refresh the page. So, of course, if you, uh, you'll you be able to change the model or to edit the model. And as you can see here, we'll have the advanced option and even permissions. You'll be able even to change the uh, title of the, your site. As you can see, for me, I have no title or the title is just site for you. You can change the title also. So, let's just close this at the moment. So, now, of course, in the Joomla admin panel or here, you will have to look for content menu. You can simply go to this left panel and expand contents. So once you click on it and expand the option, you will have to click on the article plus option as you can see here. So you can simply click on it or click here. So if you click on the plus button, of course, that will take us here. Here we'll be able to add anything into our page or our uh, our websites. As you can see here, you will be able to add some content, some text content, some images and links, some options, or what's uh, if we want to publish something or configure the edit screen or even permissions. We'll be able to add a lot of other stuff. So, for example, I'm just going to add an image. So let me just select something from my PC as an example. Let just me upload something here, and let me just upload this. Why not? 
So we'll have to wait until it's uploaded. And as you can see, once it's uploaded, we'll find this here. So I'll have to simply select this. I'll have to simply select this. Of course, I can even add this uh, uh, Joomla PNG if I want to and simply click on select. Once I select this, as you can see, I'll find this here. So simply if I add the title here, as an example, I'm just going to put it this and click on save it. You can even click on save and close or save both works. So even if you close now, as an example, and go to the home screen and refresh, as you can see, you will still find nothing. Of course, for you, if you already have like a lot of uh, things on home screen, you will be able to find, if you click on articles, you will find this option right here. And as you can see, you'll find all the articles that you have in your home screen. For me, I still added my, I just added my first one. And of course, for you, uh, you'll find like the list of articles that is currently published on your website. You can look for the article that's represent the homepage. And typically, the homepage article uh, has a title like home or welcome. So you can click on and open the article for editing. And of course, you can edit the content of it. So once, of course, the, the homepage article is open for editing, you can make changes. So it's contents like the Joomla editor to format and style the text and add images, of course, video or other media and customize its layout as desired and you can also add links headings and other elements to enhance the visual appealing and readability of your homepage. so of course here uh, you can just click on it again and as i said customize this however you want as an example I just add a welcome uh, here welcome tests or welcome text and here let's just go and click on preview to see and as you can see here we'll find our home screen uh, have a test which is the title as you can see as you can see that's the title we can change it to whatever we want and we can even delete it if you want to example just delete this and click on preview to see as you can see it's still there so we'll have to go and delete this and type as example welcome and go to preview and as you can see not even changed because i did not actually save so I didn't, I didn't have to close, sorry. Go back and click on preview. And as you can see now, we'll find a welcome. And of course the the image that we already like added here, as you can see, if you click on now versions, if you click on preview again and go to this in categorize, you'll find the image that we added here. And of course you'll be able to edit this or change this however you want. You can even put it on your home screen instead or put it as your background or anything. And as I said before, changing anything, you can simply save and close, and then you'll be able to preview anything. Maybe I didn't show here, I don't know why. So let's just try to open it again as an example. I'm just going to uh, the manage option. Then simply I'll have to go and preview the or overview the site, or my site. So simply I'll have to go and open it up. So maybe there's just a problem. So don't worry about that. Once you click on preview, you'll be able to see your sites correctly. And as you can see, this is the title, this is the text that you added. And as you can see, we will have here categories. We'll even be able to add the image instead of category on the home page. So you can do a lot of other stuff here. So as you can see, you'll have a lot of options. So you go and check them by your own and familiarize yourself with that. So if you reach this point of this video, congratulations. You've successfully know how to edit your home page on Joomla website in 2023. And of course, by customizing the content, layout, and design of your home page, you can create an engaging and informative first impression for your visitors. So thank you for watching this tutorial and we hope it was helpful for you. So if you have any further questions, feel free to explore the Joomla support resources or join the Joomla community for assistance. So make sure to leave a like down below on this channel and a subscribe. And of course, if you like this video, uh, you can leave a comment down below, leave in your suggestions or your problems, as an example, and I'll come back to you as soon as possible. So thanks for watching again and I'll see you in the next video.